Hi, I'm Chris, the developer of Octolab. After quite some time and almost 100 big and small updates for 1.16, there is finally a new version of OctoApp for Android. I published the iOS version earlier this year, and since then Android was still lacking a little bit behind because it was stuck with 1.16, while iOS was already at 1.17. I finally managed to bring both platforms up to speed. So what's new? A lot of work has been done behind the scenes, but there are two main features I want to quickly highlight. The first one technically was added already to 1.16 a few weeks ago, so it's not new for 1.17, but I still want to quickly showcase it here. Octop now supports Octo Everywhere's live links, so if you want to share your webcam feed to a friend, you can now use Octo App's webcam share button to create a live link, if Octo Everywhere is connected to Octo App, of course. But the second feature I want to quickly highlight here is the real star of 1.17. It was requested for a long time by many people. Bad level visualizer support is finally here. You can now see your bad level visualizer data in the prepare state of Octo app. You can also trigger the bad level visualizer script to probe the bad using a refresh button. Once new data is available, Octo app will refresh the data shown. This is 1.17. I also started a new big project that will most likely take the rest of the year. Octoapp 1.18 is hopefully ready around Christmas. So what is in 1.18? For now, I want to keep that a secret, but it's the most, most requested feature by far. If you don't want to miss Octoapp updates and tutorials, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Since a few weeks, I'm also streaming my hobby projects and printer builds every weekend. Feel free to drop by. As always, Enjoy the app and happy printing.